And here's another here's a couple of verses I noticed in <sighs> Ruth chapter one verses twelve and thirteen. Turn again, my daughters, go your way, for I am too old to have an husband. If I should say I have hope, if I should have an husband, have a husband also tonight, and should also bear sons, would ye tarry or hope for them till they were grown? Would ye stay for them from having husbands? Nay, my daughters, for it grieveth me much, or I have much bitterness for your sakes, that the hand of the Lord or Yahweh is gone out against me. So that was supposed to be a rhetorical question. Of course, the background is Elimelech driven by famine into Moab, Malon and Chilion, having married wives of Moab, die also. Okay, by the way, he dieth there, and then his sons Malon and Chilion die. Naomi, returning homeward, dissuadeth her two daughters-in-law from going with her. Uh, Orpah leaveth her, but Ruth, with great uh, constancy, accompanieth her. They too come to Bethlehem, where they are gladly received. By the way, I hate it when people try to give Orpah a hard time for going back. Um, I look forward seeing Orpa in heaven. I just do. Orpa's fine. If there's anything I hate, I hate the fact that her mother-in-law told her to go back, so she's not going to hell. No way. Forget that. I'm not I'm not even gonna allow it. If I see angels trying to drag her off to hell, I'll just tackle them and say, You're not taking her to hell. Her mother in law sent her back to Moab, so you're not taking her to hell. So thank you very much. By the way, just notice something. Look at this. A V and a V. And you know what this is? See, this used to be U. This used to be the letter U. So you know what this was? A double U. And by the way, that says wives for the Benjamites. You know how they got their wives? <laughs> they had been almost all wiped out. And they had... The men of Israel had vowed they wouldn't give their daughters to them. So from Jabesh Gilead, the men hadn't come, so they went and wiped all the men and the women that had lined with the men and gave those daughters who hadn't known a man to the Benjamites, but they sufficed them not. In other words, there were still Benjamites that needed wives. You know what they did? Um, verse 22, And it shall be when their fathers or their brethren come unto it. Okay, wait. So, therefore, so verse 20, therefore they command the children of Benjamin saying, go and lie in wait in the vineyards and see and behold, if the daughters of Shiloh come out to dance in dances, then come ye out of the vineyards and catch you every man his wife of the daughters of Shiloh and go into the land of Benjamin. <laughs> and it shall be when their fathers or their brethren come unto us to complain <laughs> that we will say unto them, Be favorable unto them for our sakes, <laughs> because we reserve not to each man his wife in the war. For ye did not give them unto them at this time that ye should be guilty. <laughs> And the children of Benjamin did so and took them wives according to their number of them that danced to whom they caught. <laughs> and they went and returned unto their inheritance and repaired the cities and dwelt in them. I was reading this and I was thinking, see, <laughs> I'm not going to do this. Because <laughs> if I did, I think I'd sort of get in trouble. <laughs> But you know what I'm going to do? Believe. And I'm going to put it out there. Society, I want you to smarten up. Because it's pathetic. What you're doing is pathetic. And you think men like me should just pretty much go curl up in a corner and die? And that's not going to happen. What is going to happen is that God's going to finally bring me my help meet for me, my pillar of rest. And uh, when he does, it's going to turn a lot of heads. 
and people might even try to condemn it. And if they do, <laughs> I'll have to really uh, remember to have walls and not just <laughs> not just explode. Because I've been waiting a long time. And I'm not doing this. I'm not just catching my wife. I can't really do that. I'd get in a lot of trouble <laughs> if I did. But you know what I do need to do? I need to find favor with the right, you know, people. That's all I'm going to say. People that get it. People that say, you know what? This is cool. He's waited his turn. He's going to get his turn. He's going to get rewarded for all that time of just waiting his turn. I have never presumed to get my donut, quote unquote, without a ring, a cake, and a legally binding document. And I call on heaven and earth to witness it's my turn.